G'day, I'm James, and welcome to the story of trigonometry. When I teach this subject, no matter what grade level, what age group I'm working with, I will always tell the actual story, the human story behind this fascinating subject. A subject that actually fascinated my humankind for two, three millennia. It goes way, way back. And at first thought, you say, okay, trigonometry, the name trigonometry, it must be a theory about, well, what does tri mean about triangles? So in your mind, before you even start, you probably think it's a theory about triangles. Maybe you see it as a focus on right triangles, triangles at the right angle. And about all these things about calling the names of the sides of the triangles, different things, and doing ratios of sides, and get sines and cosines. And this thing in America in particular called Sokar Toa. Ugh. That's not the human story. Let me give you the actual background to this. I'm going to actually tell you that Mac Mace is a fascinating and compelling enterprise in its own right that goes back to the dawn of time. Now, I'm going to be a bit loose with my history, but I'm actually going to be correct. My story is going to be historically correct, though I'm going to be a little more, more um, less subtle about the nuances and the ambiguity. So I invite you to actually look up the proper history of the subject, this fascinating subject, and get all the nuances and the details right. I'm going to give you just the, the gist, the human story that makes this compelling for our human brains. And the thing is it starts as follows sure people have been thinking about right triangles from very early ages but really really the compelling part of the story is not trigonometry about triangles it really should be circleometry a theory about circles that is strange very strange but let me talk about it because it's actually very natural so I want to start today by talking about circleometry exactly as I would do with all my students no matter what level of mathematics we're at i would always tell the fabulous story of circleometry and then it makes sense for all the work that one does in the typical school curriculum for the 21st century all right, back in a moment, I'll start on circleometry.